Our topic for today is all about congruent triangles. So, definition, two triangles are congruent if and only if their vertices can be paired so that the corresponding sides are congruent and corresponding angles are congruent. So, example tayo. Given that we have triangle DOG and triangle CAT. And state here that triangle DOG is congruent to triangle CAT. So, this is the congruent symbol. Okay? Equal sign siya, tapos parang may N nye. Ganun. Ganun sa N nye. So, now, we're going to identify the congruent angles. And if you will also notice, di ba, uh, yung, meron silang mga tick marks. Okay? So, in a triangle, there are three congruent angles and three congruent sides. Okay? So, let's try for the angle. Let's say, so, angle D. This is angle D with one tick marks. So, dito, sa isang triangle, di ba, congruent siya kay angle C. So, angle D is congruent to angle C. Second one, say we have angle O. This is now congruent to angle A. Third one, angle G is congruent to angle B. Okay? This is the symbol for angle. Okay? For sides, this one. Okay? So, now let's identify the congruent side. So, first, let's say side, this one, D, O. So, side, D, O is congruent to side. So, D, O, C, A. Then, side, O, G is congruent to side, A, T. Diba, yun din kasi yung tick marks nila, pareho silang dalawang tick marks. Then, last one, we have side, let's say GD, is congruent to side TC. So, susundan nyo lang kasi yung mga corresponding vertices niya, di ba? Kasi, obviously, si D, okay, si point D, it corresponds, this is the symbol for corresponds. So, corresponds to, parang partner ni D kasi di ba si C. So, partner ni O, si point O, C, A. Then, partner ni G, corresponds to T. Kaya dapat, pag ito lang si D, O, D, O, C, A. Okay? Ganon. Yung magkakapartner lang. So, now, what if we have here triangle A, T, C. Okay, so what is congruent to triangle ATC? So, again, just simply look at the figure. Okay, so A, so sa kabila, we have O, then T, so O, G, and C. That is D, so O, G, D. Actually, kahit nga yung letters na lang, tignan nyo eh. Let's say, for example, we have what is we have triangle uh, G D O okay so triangle G D O is congruent to triangle so G diba kapartner niya si T so T G D so T C A so the next example we have Triangle CAR is congruent to triangle SER. Now, dito sa figure, mananotip nyo na walang mga tick marks. Okay? Pero kahit walang mga tick marks yan, okay, pwede natin pagbasihan itong given. Okay? So, uh, first, identify natin yung, yung corresponding points nila. So, si point C, okay, sino yung kapartner niya sa second triangle? So, si C, ang kapartner niya dito ay si S. Then, si A, it corresponds to point E. Then, si R, corresponds to point R. 
Okay? So, therefore, if we're going to identify the three congruent angles, so, first we have angle C is congruent to angle S. Okay? Then, angle A is congruent to angle Kapartan A, I see. So, angle E. Then, last one, angle R is congruent, of course, to angle R. Then, congruent sides. Okay. So, pag sides, diba, two points yung ginagamit natin. So, side CA. So, side CA is congruent to side SE. Then, side Let's say AR, may CA na tayo, di ba? So, AR is congruent, this is AR, congruent to side CR. Then, last one, we have third. So, we can have side CR is congruent to side SR. Now, kapag ginawa natin na side RC, it should be congruent to side RS. Okay? As if yan, uh, hindi pwede magbalibaliktad. Kasi nga, uh, yung corresponding points kasi yung pinagbabasihan natin. Okay? So, di ba kung AC naman, dapat, ang gagamitin natin ay ES. Okay? Ganun yun. So, kailangan talaga yung magpa-partner yung gagawin. So, now, let's say we have given triangle Ah, uh, so RES. Okay, so triangle RES. So RES, pabalik tad, is congruent now to triangle. So RAC. Next one, given triangle CUE is congruent to triangle RUD. So we're going to answer these questions. Okay, now if you notice, wala nang given na figure. Okay, pag wala nang given na figure, so dito lang kayo mag-focus. Again, susundan nyo lang siya. So, pag in-identify natin dyan yung corresponding points, so ba diba si C, ang partner niya, so C corresponds to R. Then U corresponds to U. Then E corresponds to D. So, therefore, angle C, okay, corresponds to or it's congruent now to angle R. Diba? C, first, then, sa so second track, yung first, then. So, U, R, nasan ba si U, R? Ito, U, R, okay, corresponds now to side U, C. Then, triangle U, E, C, okay, so U, E, C, corresponds now to triangle, okay, U, D, R. Now, angle U, okay, is congruent now to angle U. Then, side EC, so EC, okay, is congruent now to side, so EC, DR. Then, triangle DRU, so DRU is congruent now to triangle EC, U. Then, side RD, okay, is congruent now to side C, E. So, that's it. Uh, ito lang yung lesson natin ngayong araw. So, di ba madali lang siya yung congruent triangles. Okay, ayun lang yung pattern-pattern na siya partner-partner.